16. Well That's done. Fun. Show the trophy. Yeah. So, uh, how'd you like your deck today? It was good. It was good. I was a little scared uh, coming from last week because Dredge top forward. And usually when Dredge does good, people bring more uh, sideboard cards in. Yeah, I mean... But I dodged them. Do you play Dredge regularly? Is this like your uh, deck? This is the first tournament I've played Dredge in, but I've had the deck for I've had the deck for like seven months. So yeah. I've, I've had experience with it. First major tournament anyway. Is there a so. lot of Legacy around here? No. <laughs> do, no. Do you, do you play Legacy when you can around here? Yeah. So. Yeah. And I enjoy Legacy. Yeah. The expanded card pool and everything is pretty good. Yeah. Dredge your favorite deck or? Um, no, I wanted to play Rug Delver, but I don't have Tarm Voice. That's a beating. Yeah. So I mean, we'll like, try. had you had them, would you have played Rugged Over? Um, I'm not sure. A friend of mine had them, and he might have given them to me. But I didn't want to pick up a deck a week before. Because yeah. I have Blue Red Delver. Sure. I've played that before. And uh, they, uh, it was, like, last Saturday that I would have got the Tarm Voice. And I know the deck is uh, kind of skill-intensive. Sure. So that's just more autopilot. It's yeah, better yeah. for me. <laughs> so, over the course of the day, did you run into any hate that you had to, like, power through? Did you beat any Tormod's Cribs, Relic of Progenitus's? I did beat um, an aggro loan deck that played a uh, ley line, turn one. Did you, like, Nature's Claim it? Uh, game two, I did inside the Nature's Claims in, so... Wait, did you game win game two, two? No, 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 no. <laughs> game two lasted approximately half of a turn. And then oh, that's the line of the void. Cool game three. Yeah, cool game three. Side in the side in the nature's claims. Did he have ley line game three? Yeah, he, he had a game three. And as then well. you had turn one claim. I had two. Yeah, I had two claims in my hand actually. Okay. Yeah, and then his hand just killed him. His normally. hand just didn't do anything. Yeah. So I mean that was a hard. There was uh, the one loss I had was Maverick, okay. and that's just a rough. That's yeah. a really rough matchup. Yeah, you I said won. I won game one. I actually beat two Maverick decks on the day. The one I lost, I won game one because I commented in turn two yeah. with uh, with Flamekins out. Cool. But the uh, yeah, his game two and game three, he played a Thalia and a Scavenging Ooze in one of them. And the other one, he played a Scavenging Ooze at a Crypt. Yeah. Really Almost, hard to beat yeah. all that stuff. It's really hard to beat multiple. And Thalia is beating because if I have one land, I can only cast one spell turn. Yeah. I saw that you sideboarded in Firestorm a lot. Uh, yeah. What was Against your the, thought process? The counterspell that? decks. Um, the, the, it varies like person to person. In the finals, for instance, uh, David didn't seem to be counterspelling my discard spells, which right. I, I find to be unusual. Because yeah. sometimes in Dredge, you keep one. If you have a hand that has a land, a dredger, and whatever random spells left, if you only have one discard outlet and they counter that one discard outlet, you're going to sit there for four or five turns not doing anything. So the Firestorm is quote unquote uncounterable discard. Yeah, yeah, yeah because, it's insurance. Because the cost, uh, the cost is, is pitching the cards. So I'll always get the cards into the graveyard. Right. So basically so, just buying a little extra insurance that yeah. if he counters your faithful saluting with a daze or a spell pierce yeah. that you can at least come back you know, right. dome him for two, dome yourself for two, discard two dredgers, get the ball rolling the next yeah. turn. Cool. Uh, would you recommend this for someone <laughs> to play next week? <laughs> Probably not. No. I mean, you can. You just have to be lucky. You have to be <laughs> lucky to win the tournament. I mean, you you had to beat a fair number of uh, show and tell decks on your way to this trophy here, right? Um, two, I believe. I mean, do you like your matchup against those? I mean, I can combo faster than they can. I, I mean, yeah. I didn't, but I have the ability to turn to somebody. T technically, yep. the deck has the ability to turn one somebody if you just have amazing hand. They have no disruption at all. Yeah. With multiple lines on diamonds and the perfect, like, dredging into multiple grave trolls and whatever. But yeah. that's pretty rare. Um, the dread return target that I enjoyed the most was Grissel Bren. He performed well for you? Oh, yeah. Won me three games. Wow. At least three games. That's pretty insane. Yeah. Because the turn he comes out, if if it's not if it's not against a counterspell deck, and yeah. you sack, it doesn't matter. You don't have to sack um, like non-token creatures for value. You just sack three creatures, get Bristlebrand, and then yeah, and draw seven, and flip the deck, and put a, get a Flamekins out into play. Awesome. And 
Yeah, I did that. I did that three times. Very cool. Today, so that was that was a lot of fun. <laughs> yeah. Well, congratulations again. Right. Yeah. Thanks a lot. Enjoy your trophy. All right. And uh, have a great night.